All right, welcome to my next video, everyone. This is Nathan, and thanks for joining in and taking a look. This is me. <laughs> Hello. So this is a 2008 Land Rover Range Rover Sport HSE. And now this is going to be a test drive video, but before I take this on a road test test drive, I wanted to demonstrate uh, the four wheel drive of this Range Rover. Uh, as you may or may not know, these are four wheel drive high, they're, they're, they're four wheel drive all the time vehicles. So uh, right now it's in high four wheel drive. Right now I have the suspension on the highest setting on the uh, off-road height selected. So in normal high, you really wouldn't know um, any different. Um, so we're going to put it in low. So we put the regular transmission in neutral push the electronic button there to change it into low and it says low range selected so now that that's been changed we can put it back in drive <clears throat> and I'm just going to demonstrate that it is operational here the other interesting thing about Land Rovers is that it doesn't jerk and pull like most but you can hear It's, it's, it is working, but it doesn't jerk and pull and crank like, like most four wheel drive vehicles would. Even when you turn the wheels sharply like this, it's minimal, minimal pulling, but. So that is truly not needed unless you are really, really stuck. Um, even to drive on this type of snow right here, we can do this real quickly. I'm gonna switch it back to four wheel drive high because it is truly not necessary to drive on snow like this in low operate just fine in high range four wheel drive. This Range Rover is Buckingham Blue. If you didn't watch the uh, first video, take a look at that. I do a, a long uh, walk around video of this. Uh, it's Buckingham Blue with beige interior. Runs and drives excellent. That's uh, a great value for a Range Rover. Being priced under $10,000. Uh, oh, so when you have it in, uh, off-road height suspension if you go over 20 miles an hour for an extended period it tells you slow down or vehicle will lower because it does not want you to drive in the off-road height at higher regular road speeds so uh, if you're interested in this uh, give me a call or text I've got my phone number listed in the comments section so as you can see, I drove through this area here and uh, took some pictures of it uh, over there, but you can see that no one has driven on this snow here, right? So we're going to do that. There's a short curb right here. But you can see the ease at which this operates through snow, even in four wheel drive high. I haven't done this clearly because no one has been on this snow don't well, we might have to switch it into low we'll see just mild acceleration through this pretty deep snow and see four-wheel drive high the whole time look how deep it is right there where I had it backed in 
it's working hard, but we made it up. We made it, made it through. <laughs> so you can see how deep those tracks are. And that's in high. It would certainly do even better in low. So that gives you a sense of Land Rover capability. All right, now we're going to uh, lower the suspension back down. So we're gonna push here to go back to normal height. And it's going to lower, lower back to normal height. And we'll go for a drive. That's the beauty of Land Rover. You can go off-road and it's unbelievable. And then when you get back on road, it's a luxury SUV. So continue watching. I'm going to drive this a little bit. And if you continue um, uh, watching to the end, we're going to do um, a little uh, highway piece as well. Actually, with as minimal as this traffic is today, if I can get up to speed on this road, might not need to go out on the freeway. So there is just about 70 miles an hour. <sighs> Drives nice and straight, brakes are strong. There's a couple things in the back cargo area that are moving around during this video. Some jumper cables and a breaker bar. <laughs> right there. Nice, nice, nice and smooth all the way. You can feel like the queen driving in this Land Rover. It's a great uh, seating height with how high the seat sits up here. Well, thanks for watching this far. Please leave your uh, comments or suggestions or questions uh, and subscribe to my channel if you like the stuff that I do.
Thanks for watching. All right, welcome back, everyone. Uh, now we're going to take this uh, Range Rover on a drive on the freeway. Drive's excellent, very nice, very smooth. Acceleration is great out of the V8 engine, but I like to show both uh, city driving and highway driving. See, it's smooth, straight, steering wheel's nice and straight. Take my hands off the wheel. Barely, barely drifting. <clears throat> uh, cruise control, set the cruise. Cruise works. Don't have my foot on the accelerator. Nice and quiet, very quiet cabin. Even the sunroof shade is open right now and still pretty quiet. That's almost 90 miles an hour right there, still extremely smooth and straight. This is a fantastic vehicle, fantastic vehicle for the price. Going to get off the exit here and going to go right back the same way we just came. So if you've seen enough, you can tune out at this point. But of course, I appreciate if you watch the whole thing and listen to me talk. <laughs> um, if you're just Skipping ahead to this point, you may want to go back to the beginning, which is where I demonstrate uh, the four-wheel drive through some snow and things. This is very amazing uh, off-road and does a fantastic job through some pretty deep snow with no problem, without even having to go into four-wheel drive low. Here we go again. This Land Rover has a nice history, a clean Carfax report, and uh, lots of routine service at the local Land Rover dealership throughout its lifetime. Has a brand new key right there. The key isn't all. Uh, sticky and icky like they usually are. It's very nice because it's brand new. I'll say it again. I said it earlier in this video, but such a great height on these Land Rovers, you know, just sits up where we're driving at the normal suspension level right now. Um, of course, because you can't drive at the high suspension uh, while you're driving at these speeds, but just such a nice seating position to be able to see out over the road and the other cars. Eighty-two miles per hour right there. This no hands. <laughs> Does fantastic, drives fantastic.
someone, I just honked that horn just because I like to honk horns, but someone asked for me to start honking the horns on my driving videos, so that's for that person. I appreciate your uh, taking the time to watch this video all the way through if you've made it to this point. Uh, I enjoy to um, make content and make videos about cars. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel. Uh, leave any comments that you would like, positive or negative. I, I take them all with sincerity and I appreciate them. Uh, if you're interested in buying this Land Rover, uh, my phone number is published in the comments section. Uh, you can get a hold of me. But real nice vehicle, nice vehicle for the money. So again, I'll flip my camera real quick. My name's Nathan, and thanks for watching. Bye bye.